You take steps forward. Hideo, you take steps upward. And you begin moving into the castle. Um, you all move forward, and you see an assembly of men positioned around barricades awaiting. Boys and girls, um, I feel like there's been, um, some form of miscommunication outside. Um, we were hoping to speak with Tokuyama. That's his Tokujin, name, right? I believe. Tokujin? Toku. The, uh, suddenly, from above, you see a figure stepping forward. It seems to be the general. He walks with two guards, the ones who were guarding the gate earlier, and he speaks. That is Lord Tokujin to you. I am Hanmaru, captain of the guards. And who the hell do you think you are walking in here? My apologies. Uh, he steps very, very slowly forward, hands up. I am Okiyama Buru. Please feel free to call me Buru. Um, sir, I'm dreadfully sorry for this uh, miscommunication. Uh, he kind of looks around a bit more, noticing that there's one missing and tries to figure out where he is. I was thinking! <laughs> He's clapping very ah. loudly! Everyone kind of shudders with your massive thunderclaps. Show's eyes are just a beeline for Hideo every <laughs> single step of the way. She's just she's just looking off in this direction. <laughs> Hideo, you can start moving a bit more. Continue, though. Yeah, what were you thinking? Mm. Well, I was thinking that I that it might be far better for us to actually speak with him in person, just to kind of clear the air about this dreadful situation that's occurred. There's a lot of your guys out there that got dreadfully <laughs> injured. Um, thankfully, no one's dead. We made sure of that. Mm. His eyes kind of glance around a bit, uh, looking so, slightly. knowing what little I know about Japanese castles, I wasn't actually planning on scaling this part. I was planning on entering it. Uh, these... These tended to be little, little, uh, used as little storehouses and stuff. Ooh. Gotcha, yeah, that's totally fair, you can do that. Um, also, uh, you did fail did. that, but you do have a, uh, an idea. If you have some, uh, stuff in your passives you could pull out here, I believe you do. Mmm. This guy. <laughs> this guy right here. Bam. Uh, <laughs> uh, he says, suddenly, uh, Hanmaru's head turns, and this guy's like, shit. Uh, he turns, taps him on the shoulder, uh, like, Lord, my lord, I, I think we should take this seriously. What? He turns back around, giving you enough time to slip on inside. Uh, Ooh, dope. And as he talks, I don't know. This, these guys, they defeated everyone outside. Perhaps we should let them talk to Tokujin. Shut up! He snaps at the guy, and the man like, oh, of course! And he just kind of, I, I didn't do anything. I'm here. <laughs> and he kind of steps back, um, and he looks forward again. You will not be allowed to pass. You must cease your movement now, government dogs. I, Hanmaru, will guard the gate with my life. Um, you want to give me one more? You're in the tower now. What's next? Uh, so yeah, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm inside crawling along the, uh, crawling along the, the, basically, like, the support beams, um, and, uh, I, uh, it, the, is there anybody down, down, uh, below? Like, uh, like a, uh, archer setup? No one in the storage house. Uh, the archers are more up ahead, standing near the wall Okay, there. so I drop down, uh, I, I drop down off of the, uh, the, uh, what would you call it? The rafters? Yeah. Uh, I drop down off of the rafters, uh, which are just like, you know, two by fours placed across each other. And uh, I, hmm. I poke my head out uh, to see uh, everybody sort of like, you know, arrows tra or bows trained on, on, you know, whoever else might be out there. Uh, and so now I'm going to I'm going to get get uh, up against this wall and sort of knock on it a little bit. All right. <laughs> What was that noise? Whose footprints are these? He kind of looks. Hey, let's check it out. These two start moving a bit forward. Meanwhile, the conversation below is still going. Uh, if we need to keep the conversation going a little longer, can I use my "Don't you know who I am?" ability? <laughs> yeah, you can. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, oh. Stay back, government dogs. Oh. Excuse me. Um, oh, now you've upset him. Buru steps back. Perhaps you're not aware of who exactly you're speaking to. Huh? 
I am Yoshiharu no Junior, and I am the furthest thing you will find from a so-called government dog. What? I believe it would be only fair for a prominent citizen of my stature to be granted a brief audience with Lord Tokuji. I don't think that would be... He kind of stands there and looks around, uh, gazing at his archers and stuff like that. Um, he seems to be waiting on something himself, almost like he's kind of stalling. Um, he tries to engage you and you just would dole on with him. Uh, you, with that ability, you can, um, you can basically hold him for here, giving, uh, Hideo enough time to do what he wants. However, there is no diplomacy after this. You're going to make him too mad for that to be existing. <laughs> um, so Hideo, whatever. Uh, I'm going to jump down on this guy while the other one is uh, is looking over there. All right. I jump down. Uh, I, yeah, I jump down and I pull him. Uh, I pull him inside and uh, like bang his head against the wall. <laughs> oh, there's a thump noise, and the other guy doesn't seem to pick up on it though. As you quickly. Dispatch him and uh, take his clothing, I believe. Yep. All right. You change on up into that clothing real quick and uh, come back out, pick up the spear. Uh, just, just fine. You look just fine. <laughs> oh my god, that's great. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, you have control of him now. Yep. You have control of him. Just, just come, uh, oh. just come right out. Uh, like uh, clasping my hands together. Uh, and uh, I'm, I'm not gonna. Uh, I'm not gonna draw very well. No, I'm just gonna go back and kill this guy. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty fair, yeah. He's like, I don't sit, and then suddenly he feels the soft point of his spear inserting from behind, and he stops talking. <laughs> he falls down against the floor. So, sorry, pal. And, uh, <laughs> and Hideo just sort of uh, looks over. All right. Ah, if only I could get you one of those bows. You clean uh, the spear tip slightly uh, on the dirt, mm -hmm. I imagine, wiping it off, and then you emerge from back. Uh, the other guys don't seem to really care much about what you find, since they didn't hear any disturbances, they just let that be. Outstanding. Oh, that's a pretty wide... Uh, that's a pretty good distance on this thing. I start... Uh, I'm sort of measuring out the length of the uh, spear to s and, and comparing it to how far these three are from each other. <laughs> <laughs> Mental oh. man. <laughs> <sighs> and uh look over what's this guy doing uh he's moving closer to gate like gauge the gates general but like he's moving in there uh he's not paying attention to you right now okay so uh we're talking about feasibility how's this look is this is oh, this uh, piercing through all of them at one or like a big slash across oh oh, oh you'd have to stretch out but you could do that Okay. Uh, Are you like slapping them over the buttress? <laughs> uh, slap it, huh? Uh, like I'm, I'm trying to like. Are you smacking them over the edge or something, or just cutting them? Mm. Uh, no, I need their bows, or I need a oh, bow. Oh, fair. <laughs> hmm. I think if there's a way I can feasibly make this not my fault. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll just, uh, I'll just slash across. Yeah. The time for subtlety you, uh, is done. You half the weight then as you said and then you lift the spear at the very edge stretching it out the guy over here hey what are you doing as he looks over and then with a sweep you slice the back of three archers next in one blow all of them collapse screaming Ooh. as suddenly everyone reacts to the sudden noise and uh hanmaru turns uh, he's stuck behind quickly everyone mobilize mobilize and as you stand well diplomacy's falling apart all you have to do is to break through some Warm bodies and find your way to Tokajin. The retaking of this town has begun now. Okay. What are we thinking, kids? Can you clear a path for me? I want to fight their leader. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can do that. <laughs> so, yeah, what Buru's going to try and do is he's going to probably just yeah. kill this man while sprinting. Um, slam his horns into the barricade, lift it, and use it. B basically, become a human <laughs> snowplow oh, and start bashing through people. Oh my god! Okay, well, you fully charge through this man, knocking back and lifting <laughs> these up, and he's dead. 
these two spearmen <laughs> are knocked underneath the wooden post. Uh, the post almost shatters, lifting up with your head as you push it through. You're almost too strong as the shards shatter and these two also fall down and perish. Hmm. Well, if that's what you want, show. Oh, who am I kidding? I know it's what you want. <laughs> she nods. Here, why don't you just... We'll, we'll do it like the day we met, shall we? <laughs> oh, <laughs> thinks back. He bends down and uh and like retracts his uh his umbrella and sticks it in the ground at a slight angle kind of just like you know, motions with a uh, nod of his head to her oh my god so i actually predicted that i get fucking oh same wavelength i prepared uh, my blue color uh, all things in heaven on the off chance someone would fling me into the enemies <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah so i assume show if she leaps up onto the tip of the uh parasol and uh junior gives a little wave Happy landing. <laughs> <laughs> and the umbrella uh, uh, comes out in one motion and zoops uh, show high into the air and forward. Okay, show uh. is going to tuck in this fluttering ball of cloth and tendrils, and she is going to attempt to fly straight at the general. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you begin, you begin standing, Guru moves forward. He sees... Actually, move back for a second there, uh, to where you were. He stops, seeing Guru move, standing with the, the gate, he says, I told you to stop. I say again, my name is Hanmaru. My technique, the scarlet petal red. Uh, he pulls out his sword. You see an oh, aura about him. You shall taste true steel. Suddenly, out of nowhere, uh, you see him flying toward you. He's like, oh, And then, no, no way! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, outstanding. Oh, I love, I love that you had all of those prepared. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> bless you, Christian. God bless. Yeah, uh, Show just impacts the side of him with the pommel <laughs> of her sword, and he goes flying, rolls across the ground, and she points her sword at him. I'd like to request it. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, the the guy on this side looks horrified. The guy on here gives a smug look and then goes over to unlock the door. <laughs> <laughs> she turns back to Boru. Did you? Uh, uh, <laughs> you did great. She looks almost frustrated and confused. Okay, she picks up her sword and points it at everyone again. I'll fight whoever whoever feels like it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You... So I'm going to be the nice guy one more time. Uh, Buru just kind of like leans on his uh, Tetsubo and then pulls a plank of wood from one of his horns and just whips it off in the distance. We are strong enough to kill all of you. But to be fair, <laughs> we don't want to. It's really up to you how this goes, seeing as your general was defeated by <laughs> I immediately. <laughs> they they are hesitant, but they're still holding through. There's enough of them that they feel confident they can defeat you. Okay. Uh, Hideo is going to uh, s uh, step over, uh, grab a bow, and shoot this guy. <laughs> All right. He uh, holds what? and uh, raises up his spear in an order to charge you. Mm. You uh, pick up the bow, loft it, dropping the spear. I dramatically take the costume off uh, as I, as I uh, <laughs> grab the bow. You know, the, the one hand grab the, grab the thing, yeah. just pull the whole thing off like it's a tearaway suit. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Somehow. And, uh, and, and uh, point out, now, now understand this. You face the deadliest duelist that this world has ever known. My name is Hideo Fumikaze. And you're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, 
I, uh, I reach into uh, I reach into my pouch and pull out a uh, pull out like uh, a huge uh, cloud of gunpowder, uh, just all <laughs> over it. They could smell it immediately, and I pull the bow back and uh, loose it. Uh, the friction of the powder causing so small sparks in the cloud before the arrow comes out and. Uh, the small sparks created by the uh, arrow's friction against the gunpowder uh, sort of uh, sort of go off, causing him to hesitate just long enough for the arrow to just come flying out of the cloud and uh, into his neck. Oh, oh my god! Oh, Jesus. He suddenly oh, he falls down to the ground completely, thus ending the clash storm. While they get their first <laughs> turn out, uh, the guys behind kind of see their commander on the ground, but the one up here, uh, come on, we can take him. He moves forward and attempts to slash it, uh, show. You, you really don't want to do this, buddy. Oof. Alright. Instantaneously, just smoothly, his sword is knocked aside and his body cut. Show takes a step to the left as, uh, as he comes in. You don't even see the slice. She just moves and the man falls. Alright, and, uh, Hideo, you see another person approaching. Uh, he's gonna try to charge you and attack. I, I let this one I, I let this guy run straight through the cloud and uh, and yeah. and uh, he, like he charges and he just finds the dead bodies over there and I'm like sorry pal oh. and then I loose the arrow <laughs> sick bastard oh, he stumbles back landing on the parapets dropping the spear as he the arrow impacts through him uh, the other archers notice over here that something's going wrong they abandon the ramparts and start fleeing back. Uh, away into this brushy area, generally leaving the combat zone after losing their support. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, they, you hear a, a, uh, a cry of, uh, HOLD OUT! THE ARCHERS WILL SUPPORT US! <laughs> uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm getting back up on the wall and getting ready to start loosing arrows on, on the, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Junior just kind of... Uh, he, he, like, watched show as she went and just, like, punked that guy instantly and just gives a, an approving nod. And he's going to, uh, take, take the umbrella over his shoulder again and walk forward. <laughs> oh, um, you gentlemen are dismissed. Your services won't be required. <laughs> <laughs> they stare forward. And then someone checks back on where the arrows are caught, why the arrows haven't started showing up yet. Well, he sees up there, the, the archers are gone! One person yells. The rest of them realize this is the case. And then they all start backing up slowly as they see Hideo pulling an arrow. Suddenly, both flanks just start fleeing in the opposite direction, all of them at once running <laughs> trying to escape, tumbling over rocks, and generally trying to run away. <laughs> Judy turns around. Oh, I wasn't even speaking to you. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, these guys also uh, run out, uh, attempting to flee to the as far as they can, oh get away from this whole situation. I make clean wow. cuts along all of the corpses uh, with my sword mm -hmm. uh, to to hide oh. my my misdoings. Hmm. Yeah. As you all move up, the guy clicks it, uh, opens up the gate, um, and then uh, speaks around, Lord Tokujin should be upstairs. Uh, and he's like, he just kind of looks around and he looks at Hedeo, and he just kind of looks back. A last minute change of heart. I can see you all are truly just, he says through gritted sheet as he kind of walks past. Yeah, no, Sho was wandering up and she's like, oh, I see. At least there's one loyal person around. He unlocks the door. What the hell? Yeah, oh, <laughs> finally, some people who have a good judgment of character. I thought I was going to get a fight. The show picks up this guy. He's not dead. Like, she she hit him with her pommel. <laughs> some people have no honor, he says about the guy who opened the, uh, he says about the guy who opened the gate. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Truly disrespectful. You all take steps forward, moving in. <laughs> to the pagoda, taking your first steps along inside. You all uh, appear in here, moving through. You see a bunch of people trying to assemble weaponry. Ooh, he kind of looks, this one looks, so, so fast? How did you? The hand kind of <laughs> hovering 
waiting like a like a like a standoff. His sword on the table. Some of the other ones like that too. Oh, 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 oh. gentlemen! I d- and Buru just looks at them and then looks back at the crew. Are we just hitting these guys? Or are we talking? We're to hitting them? these guys. Show throws this guy at him. <laughs> <laughs> Show throws the body. She she takes a step mm-hmm. forward on the mat and uh, using. Using her sword still sheathed, she catches it in the air and swings him down like a giant doughy guillotine on this man. <laughs> uh, grabs his sword and is going to toss it to one of her mm. friends behind her. Who wants the sword in the turn? Um, I'll take it. Okay, yep. Hideo. <laughs> Alright, Hideo, you, you suddenly grab the sword. It's in your hand. Okay. One, two... Three. Ah. Oh, hello. Uh, <laughs> uh, I'm going to to rush into this group mm-hmm. uh, to this group of gentlemen. I'm going to keep them close so that they can't do wide swings. Gotcha. Um, and uh, and I'm uh, I've got the uh, the sword of the the guy who was over here in my hand, and uh, I'm starting to uh, I'm starting to sort of lock swords with one of them. And while I'm locked swords with them, I'm going to knee him in the groin. Oh, he actually doesn't have a sword right now. They don't have their swords around the table. Oh, I'm going to stab him in the back. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Much better. Just oh. like independently, one by one, I'm just going to go whoop, whoop, okay. whoop, like a trench spike. <laughs> he collapses on his sword he was grabbing for. <laughs> Junior walks at just a very slightly hurried pace over here. I'm not letting you out of my sight again so easily. Not after last time. Goodness knows, you could end up with an arrow or some sort of, hmm, terrible trash buried in you. He's gonna, he's gonna move up and, uh, and support, uh, Hideo here, um, as Hideo, uh, engages this guy and stabs him through the back. Actually, yeah, you know what, he'll, he'll come here, and, so this man has a sword through him right now, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, Junya's going to... Uh, Junya's going to poke, uh, the, poke his umbrella into this guy's back and open it up and send him hurtling forward sword first into the next man like a row of dominoes. (laughs) He clashes in, the, the umbrella projecting the sword into this man too. Both of them fall like a mess on the pillows below. The pillows staining a little more red. Uh, as almost like a blur, uh, Buru is up here, and when you propel this guy and he hits this guy, uh, he's going to pull the- grab onto the sword so the body keeps going, but the blade is in his hand, and then just whip it at this guy (laughs) as hard as he can. Uh, he goes and grabs the hilt of the sword when another one impacts him from behind, slamming him against the table as well. Hopefully just- hopefully just the butt of the sword. I'm- Buru's not here to kill. (laughs) Okay, yeah, he's unconscious then. Okay, show's just gonna walk past this guy, and uh, let's let's see if there is a dramatic cut behind her as she passes. He grabs the the two swords in his hand, holding them both, and as he moves forward to attack you, he collapses, blood pooling out from his chest as you keep. Yeah, show just keeps walking. There there was no <laughs> point at which she even had her hand on her sword. Yeah. Uh, another man approaches from around the corner, peeking out to see you, and he goes in to strike. He goes in, and as you were sheathing your sword. You weren't particularly in an Neo Jutsu strike, but you raise up and block the hilt with your own, like, uh, you block the strike with your hilt, and then what? Uh, and then, yeah, no, she blocks the strike with her hilt, and something snakes out, the back of her hair grips something on the table, and then just, shing, suddenly she's on the other side of him, and is holding the other sword, now naked in her hand, bloody. Uh, she thro- tosses it to the ground, and it clatters, and she peers around the corner, seeing uh, the other two, and just goes... Oh, okay. Draws, uh, puts her hand on her sword again. Who's next? Yeah, you guys in the main room, you just hear, like, okay, who's next? And then you just hear the sounds of steel. <laughs> uh, you move forward, and, uh, this guy flees up the stairs. Take your time. Do you want to go up the stairs now? Show, show's gonna wander back and make sure everybody in here's fine. Oh! Hey, you're, you okay, Show? Heard a lot of noise. <laughs> Are there more people back here, or no? You took care of them already. I think there's more yeah. upstairs. They all fled. They're all fleeing to the same location, so that'll be a good mm-hmm. chance to, you know. Oh wait, mm-hmm. forgot something. 
fleeing back to their master's lap like beaten dogs. <laughs> she picks up this guy again. All right, gentlemen, I'm feeling very nice today. Walk away from this, and I will restrain show. <laughs> <laughs> show they, is show is literally trying to line up a football toss at these guys with this guy's body. <laughs> they drop their swords to the ground and press themselves against the wall to be as unassuming as possible. Uh, uh, he he yells to around the corner. Jigs up! Don't even try. <laughs> oh, you uh, got friends around the corner. Yeah, that's the armory. Oh, the armory. <laughs> yeah. Really? Well, that sounds interesting. Sounds filthy. Show wandering past these two, you got lucky. <laughs> they uh full on bolt for the stairs after you pass them. Hmm. Alright. Now do be careful, Show. Tentacles peeking around the corner. <laughs> uh they they look. Uh one of them. Is, is a few of them are holding blades or spears or journalies. They're trying to get bows. They watch you, and then they just kind of have a singular moment of staring and wondering, we? And then they decide, no. Uh, they they stop and simply let you pass. <laughs> Show doesn't um, make eye contact. Would you look at that? They can learn. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is a direct order for you boys. Um, you're going to leave your weapons here. And there's a nasty hole in the inn. You're going to repair it. That was your fault. <laughs> <laughs> they all they all bolt out and start running down the hall, attempting to flee as quick as they can. If I don't see those boys out there with hammers and nails, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> <laughs> and you begin making up steps to the final floor of the pagoda. 